All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Fate Apocrypha episode 21. Uh, in the last episode, we had Atlanta versus Jan, uh, Chiron versus um, Achilles. Uh, obviously, Astolfo is off somewhere with Sieg. Uh, I'm hopefully going to see more of that in this episode. Um, and yeah, some kind of plans going ahead. Obviously, Mordred still yet to be seen, but uh, I guess we will see in this episode. Um, so, as always, guys, I like the video if you like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. Materialized souls. How would that cause the... How would that resolve the issue? That's true. Free humans from their karma. He's got a point there. Yeah, that's so cool. Good question. Where is she? My teacher, Sensei. Damn. Are we doing it? Are we unleashing the phantasm? Yes, let's go, Stolvo. Yeah, he's different tonight, though. You gotta find out. Oh, there's some powerful shit coming out, coming out right here. Oh, damn. There's some laser. What is the phantasm? It's like pages from a book? What is it? Casa de la Gestia. Damn, it looks like a mini son. Oh, it's blocking it. Or is it absorbing it? Like, what's happening? Damn. Asolfo doesn't seem to be struggling at all, either. Let's do this. Let's fight that noble phantasm. Let's go. Oh, that's so good. Oh, the sound design. Defense against Magecraft. I don't feel like that's it. I mean, that could be it from that phantasm, but I feel like there's more to it. Oh shit, we've got a problem. Connor's here. Wait, was it an illusion? A dimensional leap? No way. That's sick. Bro, is Stolfo getting respect? And William Shakespeare. Shakespeare's just writing his goddamn shit, bro. Okay. Hmm, wow, that's cool. I mean, hopefully someone takes over this battle for against Karna because I don't know if Astolfo's up for it. Then go crazy. Go stupid. Let's go, Saber. Ridiculous Lance. Yeah, this is the, the big opponent for you. Sieg. Take over, Sieg. Oh shit, here we go. So not only is he applying or oh, kind of giving Astolfo a shit ton of magical energy, but now he's going to transform into Siegfried. That's insane. Jan ain't gonna like this. Yeah, and now Khan is aggroed. <laughs> Oof. Yeah, for real. Straight into a phantasm. Wow. What is it they're taking down right now? Like, is it what keeps the fortress afloat, or...? Come on, Astolfo. Oh, no. Oh, no! Jesus, dude. Bro, that, that looks like a hit hippogriff as well. Oh, come on. We're not losing Astolfo here. Jesus, dude. Oh shit, they're going down. No, they're glowing. No! <laughs> Fuck, man. Who's here? Mordred? Are they crashing the jet? Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Yeah? Okay, let's see it. 
Not these names aren't easy to say. What the hell is this? Did it stop time? Overwriting the world. Wow. Okay, Dio, I see. That's freaking nuts, man. It's so quiet, too. That's so crazy. On the name of my father. Oh, this is going to be good. Are they fist fighting? I don't think you can unleash it. What? Bro, this is a this is an honorable fight, man. Oh, let's go. I wonder what it looks like outside of this area, like to anybody watching. Bro, this is so good. Oh, shit. Yeah, they're like neck and neck right now. Bro, this is so good. This is so good. No, like, not even just powers. It's just straight up strength beating the shit out of each other. What a cool battlefield as well. Like, on a plane in stop time. They are both, like, feeling this shit, man. Ooh. Ooh. Holy shit, Kaeron. Bro, this is brutal. And he's still, like, stepping on his on his sash. God damn. Bro. With the donut? Really? Fuck, man. Bro, Kid was really beating his ass like that, too. Oh, man, come on. That's a big conviction, bro. Hopefully you can. Lend them your noble phantasm. What? I'll think about it. Oh? Wait. Wait. What? They hit him in his Achilles tendon. Oh my god. What? He shot an arrow from the stars into his weak point. Bro, Kadon's a fucking G. Let's go. That was such a cool phantasm. Oh, it, ooh, oh, here we go. Atlanta versus Jan, then. It's quite poetic that what Kadon wanted was an immortality. So in the end, he managed to take away Achilles' uh, 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 immortality. Wow. But they were already dead. They're souls. She just sent them where they need to be. Yeah, for real. Alanta, you've lost the plot. Press X to doubt, but go off. Oh, Jesus. What is happening? What is she turning into? Damn, what is that? What? Oh, shit. Oh, Astolfo. Where's Mordred? I can't believe Mordred just flew the jet into them. Jesus. Wait, is that Achilles? What is it? Oh, God, what's going to happen? I'm so tense. All right, so that was Fate Apocrypha episode 21. Jeez, a lot of a lot happened in that episode. Um, really, shout out to Astolfo for coming in clutch and taking out this kind of fortress. What's going on here, or kind of the weapons that uh, it doesn't seem like it's uh, he's there to take out the fortress itself, like or its ability to fly, more like the weapons that it was using against the other servants. Uh, really cool moment there. I honestly, I thought for a second Astolfo was going to die right there. Oh, I was about to break out in tears. 
Um, but uh, yeah, Mordred came in clutch, <laughs> flying a jet into them. That was kind of wild. Uh, and then kind of the, the main part of this, of this episode, which I loved, was the fight between Caedon and Achilles. And that, honestly, wow, that was just really freaking good. Like a really, truly honorable fight um, between, obviously, teacher and students. Really freaking good. And Caedon was putting in work. Honestly, if it weren't for kind of the last, the miss, and he just left himself wide open for the, you know, the killing blow. Um but to end it all off with finally his phantasm which was an arrow shot from his own constellation from the stars was really freaking cool um and to to make it so that it took away uh, achilles's uh, immortality honestly a very very cool thing uh, and so it means that achilles in this battle now uh, battle now is open to dying um and yeah that just makes it just quite a bit more interesting um, and then kind of ending off here then with Jan and Atlanta with some kind of new form that she's taken over, almost like a, like an altar form, maybe like a, just an evil form, but not too sure as to what it is. Guess we'll find, I'll find out in the next episode, hopefully. And um, yeah, and then something's happened with both the riders right here. Who knows? But overall, a very freaking good episode. I'm definitely looking forward to the next. So as always, guys, um, thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have an nice rest of your day and peace out, guys.